This is George of Wars doing an update, letting you folks know that something crazy happened. Something really crazy happened. Okay, well, I was decided because I was I was listening to subliminal messaging, subliminal, um, subliminal, and it's been working for me. And I was saying, you know, because we've been trying to get this super suit, we've been trying to get this, we got the narrow link. Tell the president's near matrix to work. We got all this stuff to work. Uh, but it's not working up to par. It's not working how it should be working. It's only partially working. So I was, I was thinking to myself, you know. As somebody said, if you want something to be a real thing, uh, you have to do the perception reality. The feelings, emotions. Um... It has to be in your perception reality if you want to make it real life. If you want to make it a real thing, it has to be in perception reality. So I was thinking, I was thinking, you know, this sub, you know, our subconscious, our subconscious, our subconscious, our superconscious, our god conscious, our emotional conscious, all our unity conscious, our astral conscious, our galactic conscious, our god conscious. You know, we also have sixty-five consciences. Why don't we just put all the infinities? All the requirements need to require all the genetics. Uh, 1743. Well, we put everything the seals, planesta, and children, things like planesta, and because they got some limited capacity. Well, we put everything in, in our in our conscience because that's our perception reality. And so now, NC. I already am feeling it. My super suit, my super suit is activated. Like holy cow, my super suit is activated. So that's that's how. So I went and did a whole poem called prayer of my word, and I put everything in all our conscious. Anything that's a conscious, anything that we can put in, and we put in affinity genetics. That's need to require because remember everything's genetics. And look, everything's coming to life, and some crazy stuff is gonna happen today. Some crazy stuff is gonna happen today. So already, I'm my mind is like my mind is blowing up, and it's all about just putting things in our conscious. Because you know that's the subliminal messaging does. It puts it in your subconscious, puts it in your subconscious, puts it in your gut conscious. And I use um, I use. The custodians, the watchers, the guardians, the keepers, the guardian. I use every technology possible, everything we got. And I also put the keys, the master keys, the grandmaster keys to the the void of the universe, everything, in our conscience. So that that makes it a real thing. That makes it because it's in our perceptual awareness. If we put uh, put a master key, we put something that's supposed to be a uh, fantasy stuff. We will put it in our con our conscious. That's our perception awareness. That's right around here. That becomes a real thing. That that makes it a real thing. And sure enough, it, it really did make it a real thing. And right now, a lot of the cabal and everything like that are are trying to figure out what to do because they have to take all their people out back and shoot them. Because now now their perception reality knows that everything is real life. Everything is everything is a real thing. Everything I'm saying is a real thing. And nothing's ever going to be the same now. Not everything's put in our conscious, our awareness. And, and now everybody, everybody's going to realize in, this instantly. People are going to know it's a real thing. Instantly. Boom. So it's a real thing. Look at this. Show me what a no looks like. Show me what a maybe looks like. Show me what a yes looks like. Is this the whole truth? The truth of everything I'm saying? And there's a whole truth and truth, but um, that's what, um, all the stuff that we're doing. It's been put in our um, our perception awareness. It's in our perception awareness, so it makes it a real, real thing. It's a reality, and that's how you get fantasy to real life. That is actually how you get fantasy to real life. That's how you get like things that are make believe, things that are made up. That's how you get them to be real life. Is that the whole truth and truth? That's how you get fantasy to real life. And it's something that comes from the spirit realm. 
some that's you know such make believe such such uh, uh, we out there. That's how you get to real life, and you attach phase in, phase in, and a whole bunch of trillions of other things need to require. And that's how you make it a real thing. And right now we have it. Everything, all our fantasy stuff, is in our perception awareness, and it's becoming a real thing. Another whole truth, truth, and we did it by putting everything in the conscious, like subconscious, subconscious. Super conscious, God conscious, actual conscious, galactic conscious, unity conscious, emotional conscious, our emotions, and our 65 other uh, conscious. Anything we can put in, we put in the whole truth, truth. And it's bringing everything to life. And more things will come to life here soon. And as the day goes on. See, not all have to do it. All that does, but the same thing. So that's how that's how subliminal messaging works. It puts it in our our conscious. It puts it in our perception awareness. It puts it actually in our subconscious, which becomes our perception awareness, and it becomes a real thing. That's why everybody's like, "How does is, is, is this sorcery?" You know, they're saying, "You know, this is sorcery. How how is this how is this actually happening?" It's subliminal messaging. That's what subliminal messaging does. It just puts it in your subconscious, puts it in your subconscious, your superconscious, and it becomes part of your perception awareness and becomes a real thing. That's that's how subliminal messaging works. And that, that's how I did it. That's how, that's how I'm getting things to become real life. That's how I'm getting fantasy to real life. That's how I'm actually getting fantasy to real life. Can you believe that? I'm getting things that I make believe, things that nobody ever thought would become a real thing. You know, plus this is the calibrators, supercomputers, uh, Krishna technology, a whole bunch of things. Hindus, the first technology. We got to the Z77 on Haikun Sari, Haikun Sari.